Hi, dear friends. The heroes. Everybody has his hero. We know many world-wide famous people. But why do we look for our heroes so far? We must just look around ourselves. That we have done. Our heroes is our school social teacher, Vladimir Kalinin. So, let's go to Vladimir's. to the Smartdown Information Center Hello. of Children of Human Rights Education. Hello, nice to see you. Mr. Kalin, we are very pleased that you agreed to answer to our questions. It's my pleasure to be with you, talk to you. So you are welcome, take a seat, and Thank we you. can start our discussions. We are reading a lot about heroes around the world, but sometimes we see that our heroes are living next to us, in our city, school, society. We know you as an ombudsman despite and we have such institution in our country in transition. Mr. Kalin, what can you say about your background? I am very glad that you come to my office to talk to me and that you define me as a hero, local hero here. Uh, well, uh, I graduated from the Air Force College in Latvia and for uh, the last 20 years I have been uh, in the Air Force from the USSR. After the collapse of the USSR, I got citizenship of Republic of Belarus and continue my military career in the Air Force of the Republic of Belarus. At the same time, I graduated from the Pedagogical University in Latvia and uh, got uh, another profession, a teacher for um, social sciences. And I started my civil life here in Smorgon as head for section uh, for social work here at gymnasium number four, then senior officer for social work, then uh, director of sport department here in Smorgon, and now I am uh, director of uh, Smorgon Information Center of Children Human Rights Education. I uh, graduated from many international courses in Nottingham University where I was uh, studying international human rights law in Belgium University, children rights law, and uh, in Austria, in Peace Studies and Conflict Resolution and many, many certificates you can see here just to get new knowledge about children human rights because uh, during my Air Force uh, service, military service, I know pretty well about human children rights violation around the world. And now I learned a lot just to know international human rights and children rights standards, how to defend and protect children rights. It's very important issue here in country in transitions, but I guess that around the world as well. So, and what you have done in the field children rights education, promotion and protection? Well, I founded here in Smorgon the first NGO, non-governmental organization, uh, with the name of Smorgon Society for Human Rights. Uh, I wrote three books, two in Russian language and one in English in cooperation with Brazil High School from Sao Paulo, cultural bridge between Belarus and Brazil, uh, then manual for social workers here, uh, how to deal with children human rights at school, family, society, uh, children rights passport for uh, use in Belarus and now uh, I am working as researcher in the field of human rights education appointed by, the, by our Ministry of Education for the last six years. So uh, my experience and all these actions and activities Ministry of Education disseminated very widely all schools here, 37 schools we have here, and they um, just follow our exper uh, experience and uh, our good practices in the field of uh, human and children rights education and disseminate our information and materials among teachers, students and etc. We created code of conduct, we started peer education on children rights, uh, we have here uh, voice of ombudsman, well, a volunteer school service for monitoring children's rights at school and uh, for feedback with school administration. I am doing a lot just to support children uh, and to make their voice to be heard at any levels of our society. 
So maybe you define me as a hero because of my activities, I don't know, but I don't feel that I am a hero here. Mr. Kalin, our last question about your hobby. What do you like to do? What you can do? Okay, I have a lot of hobbies, yes, but I have not too much time to realize myself. But I am keen in fishing, for instance. Uh, I like to work on my PC, to search on the internet, for instance. I can play guitar as well. I like to do physical training because I founded here a sport club for children with de uh, deviant and delinquent behavior just to recorrect them and integrate into school society. Uh, so I can show you a small piece of art and just play a bit on guitar. to you. We will send our video to My Hero Project in USA and a lot of people will read about My Hero living here and now. Thank you, it's an excellent idea and I would like to support all your intentions because you are our future and I am sure that you will do your best just to defend and uh, disseminate knowledge about children and human rights around the world. Thank you so much. Thank, Thank you very much. much. Goodbye. Goodbye. Bye -bye. Thank <laughs> you.